21 and 23 SAS make up the reserve units of the SAS. These units provide those unwilling to commit themselves full-time to military life with the opportunity to become a member of the Special Forces. However, unlike the full-time SAS, where their selection process is well known and there is plenty of information online, there is very little information about the specifics of joining the SAS reserves. In order to join the SAS as a reserve soldier, those with no previous military experience must be between the ages of 17 years and 9 months and 42 years and 364 days, be able to complete a 2 km run in under 10 minutes 15 seconds, throw a medicine ball 3.1 meters, and complete a 76 kg mid thigh pull. Prior to undergoing SAS selection, they must complete basic military training courses. These are Alpha Training, which takes place over four weekends, and Bravo Training, which is 15 and a half days. Alpha and Bravo make up Phase 1 of basic training for reserves. Following on from this is Phase 2, the two-week long combat infantry course at Ketrick, where the basics of combat are taught. Furthermore, those with previous military experience are able to apply for the SAS reserve up until the age of 50 years and 364 days. Following on from basic military training, the SAS reserve selection begins and is split into three phases. Phase 1 is the Hills Prep Course. This is a progressively arduous course of drill nights and weekends over several months, requiring a candidate to demonstrate mental and physical robustness. It is designed to prepare applicants for the rigours of the aptitude phase. The aptitude phase consists of a series of progressive marches against the clock, which culminates with a testing endurance march over arduous terrain. Upon completion of this phase is the final phase, the standard operating procedures and tactics course. This is six months of training over drill nights and weekends. Candidates receive instruction and assessment on Special Forces tactics, techniques and procedures, including weapons and SOPs. During this progressive course, new skills are taught whilst candidates are under mental and physical pressure. The course culminates in a two-week final exercise, which if completed, candidates will be badged as SAS soldiers. Following the completion of the UK Special Forces Reserve Selection Course, Soldiers will enter a 24-month period of probation, which will require the completion of a basic parachute course, a communication course, and a Survive, Escape, Resist and Evade SERE course. Thanks for watching this video. Make sure to check out the others on screen now and subscribe for more.